Welcome to the channel. The silent demo was trying to show the three different ways you can switch presentations from within PowerPoint. We're going to go over those in just a moment. But you may ask, why do I need to know this? Because knowing how to switch efficiently between between presentations will save you time for you and your audience while you're presenting. It avoids and against the time to leave this program, open up another file, and the time that it takes for that file to open. Another reason you need to know this is that it will make you look more professional. You will have the appearance of mastering the program. And that's what we all want to do. We all want to make, we want to look as if we have the command over the software at all times. And as I mentioned, there are three ways to do it. And it depends on where you are in PowerPoint. So the main thing you need to remember is please have all your files up and running. It will save you time for the loading. And we're going to go over the alt tab option, which is one of the three options in Windows. So you simply go to view, switch windows, and you'll see the other files that are running. And the checked one is the one that is currently active. A second alternative is to use the infamous alt tab, which works in any view. and you will then be able to see all the programs that are open, not only just PowerPoint. So these three red boxes are the slideshow views that are currently open. And the blue boxes are the same three files in edit view. And you can tell the difference because edit view will have the edit, all the edit options around the slide where the slideshow view will only show the slideshow view in that window. And there's one other option from presenter view, whether you are in single or dual screen mode, you simply go to show taskbar and your next item will look just like if you press the windows key, you'll see the, you'll see the other choices of PowerPoint that is open and you can click on whichever one you want to switch to. So now let's do it live and you can see how it kind of flows. So from this edit view of this file, you simply would go to view, switch windows. And if you want to go to custom shows, it will take you to, to the custom show file. You want to go somewhere else you could go to the support document files but note once you start an edit view and switch you are still in edit view so that's technique number one if we press alt tab now you see the three options again plus any other documents i may have open and it's a simply a matter of clicking that document and you switch. Press Alt-Tab again. So that's option number two. From presenter view, you would simply go to show taskbar, click on it, go to PowerPoint, and you'll see the five items three edit views and two other presentation views. 
Actually, this is slideshow view and the background presenter view for this particular document. And here's the edit view. Here's custom shows and here's support documents. You can see Windows switching between the PowerPoint documents. So that is the third way of switching between, between presentations. So to recap, it's relatively easy to switch between presentations. The main thing you want to do is have your presentations, your other presentations up and running. You can switch from within PowerPoint by going to view, switch windows, and it'll show the options and you can select the one you want to go to. The other way is using Windows command of Alt tab and you can select the one you want. And the third way is from presenter view by clicking on show taskbar and it'll show you all of the items that PowerPoint has running. Let me know if you have any questions. Let me know if you have anything you want to see differently or added to this and we will work on it. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe so that you can be aware of other videos coming out, typically Wednesdays at noon central time. Share with others and subscribe so you'll be notified. Thank you very much. Leave me any comments in the comment field if you have any questions or comments or suggestions. Thank you very much.